How to lower your blood pressure. If your blood pressure is 140 over 90 or higher, you need to get it down. The good news is that many of the steps you can take are painless and some are downright enjoyable. You will need potassium rich foods, red wine, a pedometer, dark chocolate, a pet, and spirituality. Step one, consume less sodium, which contributes to hypertension. It's not enough to just put away the salt shaker. Check food labels as well. Many prepared foods, like canned soup and frozen meals, are loaded with sodium. Step two, eat more baked potatoes with the skin, plus other potassium-rich foods like acorn squash, bananas, orange juice, and halibut. Dozens of studies prove that a potassium-rich diet helps combat the blood pressure-raising damage of a high-sodium diet. Step three, drink one glass of red wine every day, but limit yourself to just one glass. Step four, lose weight if you need to. Obesity has been linked to hypertension. Track your steps with a pedometer. People who use them walk up to 2,000 steps more, which can help them reduce their weight and their blood pressure. Step five, get a pet. Not only does having one lower blood pressure, petting them has been shown to increase levels of the feel-good hormones dopamine and serotonin in their owners. Step six, eat some chocolate every day. The trick is to keep the portion small, say bite size, and make sure you're munching dark chocolate made mostly from cocoa solids. It should taste a little bitter. Step seven, become more touchy-feely. Research indicates that people who hug and hold hands are calmer. Step eight, start praying. One study found that people who attend weekly religious services have lower blood pressure than those who don't attend at all. Did you know? By 2025, 1.6 billion people worldwide are expected to have high blood pressure.